Alright, so Cog2 Glitch for Universal Studios. Now, I don't know exactly how strict the mods are for this game, and I don't want to find out the hard way, so it's possible that they're just going to let this slide, like they won't care if it is a glitch, but it's po also possible that they're going to be as strict as the GTR mods and just ban anyone who they see doing it. But, so I would just be very careful doing this, because you don't know how they're going to react to it, and I don't want to find out the hard way. But anyway, what you do is you invite a friend to a boarding room. Then you try to leave the area, you get this message, so then you press go twice, now you can move again. Then disband the group, or you can just have your friend leave, it doesn't really matter, and then you go home, you need to use the book, or you can just click clear bell. Okay, so now, what you want to do is you want to go into the door, and then when the door animation starts, you want to click the X on this message you have up here. Then, right before the screen goes completely black, you want to press escape to open your book. You don't, if you do it too early, then your book will be closed on the other side. If you do it too late, then your book just won't open at all. So, you kind of got to time it correctly. You can tell, well, all you have to do is that, like, you know how the, um, the game fades into black? Just wait until there's almost, until it's almost all black, and then press escape. It should be easy as that. Anyway. Could take you a couple tries, maybe it won't, but here you go. Okay, that book's open. And then. Yeah, for some weird reason, your tune will automatically go back to the door, going back to the side. I don't know why, but it happens. So all you have to do is just back up, and you go back into the door. Now, you want to walk to your phone. If your phone, if you don't know where your phone is, that most likely means that you moved it, and if you did move it, you gotta move it back to uh, where it is when you first made your tune. That way you can just press the up arrow and your tune will be brought right into it. Other than that, yeah, press the up arrow to interact with the phone. And then you'll see in a second what happens. So if you, if you can't just go straight and run into it, then you gotta do adjust it so that you can. Once you do that, press hang up, and now you can see uh, you can see where you where you're, where you're running. The pages will still turn when you press the arrow key, so just be a little careful with that. And you can press F3 to see you better. Just, uh, be careful that your pages will still turn even when you're F3 mode. So listen to this. I think you might be able to hear that. Look at that. See the page just turned. You can see the the fish from the fishing page. All right. Okay. We don't want to do that. Okay. Don't click any of these teleport options on the map. That will close your book and you might just get stuck. What you want to do instead is switch districts. Any district will do, go to just one that's empty, but if you really want to show it off and risk getting banned, then go to the one that's the most full or go to the one that has an event going on. Um, as of now, me making this video, there is an event happening in a couple days, but I'm not going to do the glitch because I don't want to get banned. I don't know if they'll ban me, so be careful. And your book will stay open while you teleport. Now, this can be done in any headquarters. I'm just going to be using Boss by Headquarters as an example, also because I don't have a promotion cellbot yet. So, I'm using the Boss by Headquarters. Anyway, go into the boss room. And your book will still be open. And, and what it says on your map is, boss is uh, we're in the lobby area for the boss, which you don't usually see because you're not supposed to have your book open first place, so that's pretty cool. All you gotta do is go in the elevator, wait for the timer to go down, and I'll, and I'll tell you what to do next. Just make sure not to click any of the like teleport areas, because again, your tune will get stuck, your book will close, your tune will get stuck, it'll just make the thing worse. Ruin the whole thing, so. Uh, yes, you can probably explore your book. Who knows really, but yeah, so. Anyway. Wait, wait, well, where you, re where you really want to be is in your district page, because that's where you're going to go next. So, when the elevator closes, you'll, I'll take with you next. Okay, actually. So yeah, there's nothing on the on the map page, because it's not supposed to have it. Anyway, switch districts. Before the, that, that cutscene ends, you want to switch districts. Now you're back outside, with your cog suit on. Now, all you gotta do is close your book. Now, uh, you're... Tune will be in a weird trance where you're, you don't have any animations, but that can be fixed by just 
leaving the area. Leave the area. For some reason, your tune will walk really slowly at the beginning of the tunnel. I don't know why. Also happens when it comes out. See, that's weird. I don't know why. Okay, now, there are your animations. And other people can see you with this. I have tried it, and another tune, and my other tunes were able to see me like this. So, just. Uh, I, so try it, if you want to show it off to other people, do it at your own risk, because they could report you or ban you. So I wouldn't risk that myself. <laughs> I want to get on the most side. Nice do anything you could already do with a tune, except access your book. You cannot access your book. You can swim, like that. Okay, well if you swim, your uh, animations will just be a little messed up with that. You won't actually be swimming, you'll just be in whatever animation you're in moving. So right here it's walking. If you manage to fall in, you'll get frozen basically. Now, if you go for a swim and you come back down, you'll notice your book is back. Don't click it. If you click it, you will be stuck and you will not be able to get out of this, this trance. So, don't click it. So that means you can't teleport anywhere. You can't switch districts, you can't teleport around, you can't, you can't do any of that. You gotta navigate yourself through King Town without your book, just walking around. This is the same thing I said for my very first Hogsy Flick video, you, you can't use your book, you just gotta walk around and the way around. Make sure you're in the district you wanna be in, and you can't switch. Uh, you also can't jump. However, there is a way you can jump. If you do the Toon Slingshot game on the trolley, at least this worked in, in Rewritten, I'm not sure if it works in Universal Studios, but you can go and try it. If you go on the trolley and go to the Toon Slingshot game, and you complete it, you don't have to win, you just complete it. Then you will, be, when you get out of the trolley, you will be able to jump. Press Control, and your tune will jump. And the cogs too. Easy as that. But I'm not going to show, show you guys that because I actually did make a video about that a long time ago using um, the glitch in rewritten of the cogs glitch, and it worked. So I'm, I don't know if it works in Universal Studios. You can go try it out, but I'm not going to go try it out because it's a waste of time. So I already know that. So I'm already pretty sure it's going to work, but. So, and also, what are you going to do with jumping in a cog seat anyway? If you go into a cog facility, I mean, like a mint or something, you might need it to jump, but I just wouldn't recommend doing that. But go try it out yourself if you want, I'm not stopping you. But the mods might. The mods might. Yeah, be anywhere. Hmm. Yeah, that's really it. And yes, you can be in a party. Actually, parties are, are, have been released yet. No, they haven't released it. Okay, that's fine. Um, so yes. You can't even teleport to friends. But, you can use Cog Speed. Oh, that's funny. I didn't know you could make boarding groups for the trolley. Can you do that? I don't know, I don't think you can do that. But anyway, yes, you can use Cog Speed. Unites, I have a Unite. Pets, Recasts, Guilds, Cog Speed. Same thing, as always. I didn't know you could make boarding groups for trolley. Maybe you can't, it's just there anyway. I don't know. Let's see here. No, nothing there. Interesting. That's something I learned new I learned right there. So yeah. Oh, I didn't know they added that too. Okay. Anyway, getting off track. Um Actually, let's go back. You can battle a cog like this. Let's battle a flunky as a flunky, that'll be perfect. Now, if I run into him while I'm walking, then my tune will be stuck walking. Like, he'll be stuck in walking animation. Or if I just let the car, you know, run into me without walking, then my tune will be frozen while battle. Let's take a picture of that. This is silly. Okay. Yeah, this is gonna look very interesting. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. Alright. So, yeah, you can battle a cog as a cog. Very, very strange thing to do with this. So, yeah. That's basically this glitch in the shell. Uh, again, oh, I'm sorry. You can't do bosses like this because, again, going into a boss lobby with this thing will. First of all, going to a boss lobby will switch your suit, and going to a boss lobby will then getting out with it keep your suit off anyway, so you can't do a boss like this. You can go into a mint like I said before, but you won't really be able to do much unless you do 
to slingshot and call yourself the jump. So yeah, let's see guys. Let's find another uh, another card. The final oh, one. Now I'm walking. See? And if I walk into him backwards, I'll be walking backwards. Hmm. This will be this will be interesting. Let's have him attack me a few times. I use some eggs. Yes, no animation. You weren't programmed to be able to do this in the game, so of course you won't make it work. Uh, let's attack him. Again. Since your tune is supposed to be holding the gag, there is no, like, tune there to hold it, so... You know. Now, I want to see what happens if your tune dodges it. And I wonder if you actually will get out of the way, or if you'll just stand there. If you will actually dodge it. These aren't, one, these aren't guaranteed hits, they're all tough to say, but... <laughs> Unless this guy is just gonna hit me every single time. Okay. <laughs> okay, I don't know what's happening. Either... Your cogs can't miss anymore, or I'm just getting very unlucky with like this. There we go. Okay, he doesn't get out of the way. He just stand, stands there. <laughs> uh, yeah. Okay, we'll lure the cog with my body. is like the perfect height for a cog like this. Okay. So yeah. Hope you enjoyed this. I know it's really 